gravity rush, gravity rush, fuck yeah, we're getting more gravity rush. Tokyo Game Show unveiled that not only are we getting gravity rush, Two, but we are getting a remastered version of the original Gravity Rush, both of which are going to appear on PlayStation 4! Gravity Rush, for all of you out there who have never had the opportunity to go and play this fantastic game, it is one of the best games that you can find on the PlayStation Vita. Hell, I've always said it was one of the main reasons you should want to go and pick one up. It was a free fucking download. That shit right there was good enough for me. I liked it so much, I bought a physical version, and then seeing the announcement of a sequel, and it was going to be on PlayStation 4, I kept on saying, I wanted to see this franchise blow up and become a lot bigger, because it was one of the better first-party offerings that Sony's ever put out. And not only is it unique and really fun, I like the story in the whole world, but just like, dude, it was so cool seeing Kat go and fly off using all of her gravity powers again. Her and Raven. Raven, who I will admit I do have a slight kind of crush on. She's fucking hot, I'm sorry. She, she just is. But them flying off and going and kicking ass together, which, you know, I won't spoil anything for you, but obviously weren't expecting all that considering this shit in the first game, but, you know, events transpire and stuff. But seeing them together made me kind of think maybe there'll be possible co-op. It would be nice to see online co-op or actual split-screen couch co-op for this type of game. And the fact that they're using the PlayStation 4 versus the PlayStation Vita, you can see how much bigger this game is. They did say that they had to scale the game back versus what they wanted to try to do with the PlayStation Vita, which was... Kind of shocking and alarming to a degree because the Vita is a fucking beast of a machine. I mean, there is tons and tons of horsepower behind that little fucking screen, those two little analog sticks. But it, it's a fucking beast, and the fact that they had to scale it back, you can see how much bigger the entire world of Hexville looks. I'm assuming it's Hexville, I mean, it looks just like it. But, you see, I'm like, dude, this is so fucking cool. I wanted, I wanted to see a sequel to the game. It's happening, and I'm glad that the original is also getting remastered and put it on to PlayStation 4, because more people should enjoy this. Now, granted, I do think that it sucks, sort of, that it won't be showing up on Vita whatsoever, but Sony has already made it abundantly clear that their main central focus is going to be on the PlayStation 4. Putting all their money and resources and shit into it makes a lot more sense. Right now, they've got over 25 million PlayStation 4s around the world sitting in homes. So it makes more sense for them to focus on that. And I understand from a business standpoint, because if they decided that, okay, we're going to do it multi-platform, then they're going to have to scale back both games and it won't be nearly as great of an experience for the development team who want to go and do shit, but they can't because the Vita version can't keep up with the PlayStation 4 version. I think you get the point. But back to Gravity Rush 2. Watching the trailer for Okay, we got to see the military obviously going fucking haywire, and I'm wondering if this, if this is like some new military that's coming in, some new regime from somewhere else off in some other different city that's deciding to invade and bring in some uh, fucking unknown armada. And you got to see all the, the Nevi... The Nevi? Is that what they're called? The little fucking shadow creature things that you end up beating the living shit out of with Cat. You got to see a whole bunch of versions of those new ones versus all, all the ones that we had seen before. And... I was happy as fuck. We're back to using all the fucking gravity powers and the hand-to-hand -hand combo attacks and it was just like, this is fucking cool. Picking up shit and throwing it, fucking everything up, flying around from place to place, going and taking stuff with you. I was like, yay, this is gonna be great. I'm curious and if they are going to be using the little gyroscope tilt controls like they did with the PlayStation Vita, I would opt for dual analog sticks more so than the whole gimmicky bullshit. And I know some people might be into that, but I just prefer traditional controls for everything because to me it's just a lot easier to pick up and play something like that versus tilting and doing all this fucking crazy shit because sometimes you swear that you're tilting this way and it's not registering something like that whereas you know, analog sticks, they're fucking doing that no matter what, unless you fucking broke that shit because you were in some fit of rage and fucking rage quitting some random game because you were like, WHAT THE FUCK?! And just losing your fucking mind all the while dropping a fucking deuce because you didn't have complete control of your colon. So, Gravity Rush 2. Cat and Raven are running around. It, I wonder if Dusty's around. They're a cute little cat. And that thing's fucking adorable, by the way. Just so fucking cute. Aw. Kitty cat, kitty cat, kitty cat. 
but I, I didn't see Dusty in it, but not necessarily like an absolute necessity to see what's in the trailer because they were just showing off a lot of gameplay and some minute kind of story, maybe a little bit. But I'm, I'm hoping that this ends up becoming a big time success. I want more people to go out there and check this stuff out because they're fun ass games. They're very unique and very different. They have the whole anime cell shaded look going for them, which I like a lot and I think that it really stands the test of time a hell of a lot better than going for like the hyper realistic look of shit where it ends up looking dated within months. And this ends up looking like a living, breathing world that you would see out of a manga or an anime just put into a 3D landscape and now all of a sudden you're flying around and kicking the living shit out of all these monsters that are terrorizing people in a place that well, you now live at. So. Gravity Rush 2, Gravity Rush Remastered will be coming on, and I want to go and make a video just talking about how fucking stoked I am for it because, well, Tokyo Game Show has been very good for releases for somebody like me so far, and I thought, why not go and share all this stuff with the world because more people should know about both those games because, well, excelente and all the other shit. So anyway, this is Alpha Omega Sin, as always, nerds, nerds, and gamers game. The fuck on. <laughs>